guys welcome back to my channel we are here on my couch getting comfortable because this is not a makeup video it's a favorites video and yeah that's kind of just what it is i go from uh skincare to working out to a little bit of sweets and just home stuff and yeah so not much to say but if you want to see all that please keep watching so I have no particular order that I'm gonna start with. I don't know if I have too many things. I kind of got excited and grabbed like a lot. So I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, so I hope it's not a long video, but if it is, something you can watch on your TV or whatever and just chill. It's not like we have anything to do right now, right? Unless you're essential, then I appreciate you. Um, first, I'm gonna start with this coffee mug. It is double sealed, so wait, here you are. It is, uh, sorry, all the, this doesn't look pretty right now because I'm drinking out of it, but it's double sealed, so it keeps your coffee um, colder if it's cold coffee or hotter if it's hot coffee for a longer period of time. And also, unlike other mugs, if you have really hot coffee, um, it won't burn your hands when you're holding it, hence the double. You see it? You see it? Yes, you do. Um, so I really like this. The only downside to this is that it's small. If you guys know me, you guys know that I'm a coffee lover. All my friends know this, so obviously I go for the big stuff. Um, but this is nice when I know I'm just gonna be sitting down and chilling and, you know, just sipping on coffee. So me not having to go back to the microwave or go and reheat it again. It's nice to know that I can just leave it there for a few minutes for a while while I watch my show or whatever I'm doing and um, it's still gonna be hot. So I appreciate that. So here you go. Mm. And if you're crazy like me and it's 10 o'clock at night like it is right now, drinking coffee, then you know, we're great. We're gonna be great friends or we are great friends. Let's start over here. So here I have skincare and I am a huge, huge fan of Ulla Hendrickson. They've helped my skin so much. They've made, they, these products have made my skin so much more hydrated. It's actually helped a lot of my scars. It's helped with my acne. And it continues to, you know, just rebuild my skin. Um, I suffer, from, I used to suffer from a lot of acne, especially in my jaw area and chin area. That's the hormonal place and these products have really helped me. And so I'm just, let me show you one, two, three, four, five. So out of all of these, the ones I'd probably really recommend is the Ulla Henderson Sea Crush Brightening Double Cream. This is an all over cream for your face. This has vitamin C, sheer butter, um, it has three sources of vitamin C in it and sheer butter. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I think it also has hyaluronic acid, uh, which also helps uh, to tighten your skin, help with wrinkles, um, and uh, just like manchas, uh, like dark spots. So this is very nice. It smells like orange, obviously. I'm halfway done. So I think out of everything, I'd probably recommend this the most. There's also an eye cream, which is over there somewhere, but I don't want to get up. Um, and I also use that. Eye cream is so important. If you don't want to use, you know, face cream, that's fine. Use eye cream because it's going to help you in the long run. That is a very sensitive area on your face. This, your skin is very thin around that area and you just need to take care of it. So if you take anything away from that, it's this eye cream. But let me just show you this whole thing that I have here. So I also have the Banana Bright Vitamin C Serum. This has vitamin C, uh, PHAs, hyaluronic acid, um, and just more vitamin C. This is also going to help you. You put this on before the cream. Uh, serums are always before cream. And this is just going to help brighten your skin. If you're consistent with it every day, you will notice your skin get so much more brighter. And you will see the luminosity coming off of your skin. And that's what you want. So these are my daytime uh, skincare and then these three are my nighttime so I'll start with the night transformation gel 
I bought this because um, my nighttime routine consists of more um, acne, like targeting acne and my scars. So this this <laughs> this helps with that. This is just uh, this also helps with it. These two kind of go hand in hand because these have retinol on it, but it's a natural retin uh, retinol, so it's not going to be really harsh on your skin. Um, what I like about Ola Henriksen is that he doesn't he doesn't use a lot of the harsh chemicals that other you know brands use. Yes, it's more obviously potent, so it's gonna affect your skin a lot faster. But at the same time, it's gonna hurt your skin. These are more on the natural side. And they still they still do the same thing, but it's a, it, it takes a little bit more time. But as long as you're consistent with it, you will still see. A difference in whatever it is that you're trying to achieve on your face so these do go hand in hand they smell so pretty and they're purple it's purple. Mm, it so pretty so yeah these are my skincare there for night and then those were for my day so um also in that area this is my I have another one but this is my cleanser this is very gentle on your skin. If you have sensitive skin, this is great for you. Um, it doesn't foam up. It doesn't um, strip the oils off of your face. It just takes off the dirt. It takes off the nest of whatever is like needed to take it off to be taken off. Um, so like in the mornings, I use this because I put so much on my skin at night, and it just leaves my skin very soft, very clean and I'm able to go I'll go along with my daily, um, why am I stuttering? <laughs> my daily skincare and it just goes hand in hand with everything else. So like I said, if you have sensitive skin or you just wanna try cleanser and don't wanna go too harsh too fast, I think this is perfect for you. There's that. And then this is new to me. But, um, I, I, I love the way it smells. It smells like, I can never say this word, you, you, eucalyptus, there you go, and spearmint, and that smells so refreshing, you feel so good. But this is the Dr. Teo's Body Wash with pure Epsom salt. I wish I had a tub because then I would just use the pure Epsom salt to soak in the tub, but unfortunately I don't have that, so this is my alternative. Uh, it says it's supposed to relax your body, relieves the mind, and it has um, aloe vera, sheer butter, vitamin E, and helps hydrate skin. So I felt a difference once I started using this. It does relax my skin. I do feel good after I use it. Uh, my body, my skin feels very moisturized after I use this as well. Um, so I definitely recommend you use this as a body wash if you would like to try it. There you go. And then this is bio oil. So this you can use all over your body, including your face. I mainly use it for my face. I used to use it for my stretch marks, but then I gave up on that. Uh, but yes, these are used, or this is used for scars, stretch marks, uneven skin tone, and aging and dehydrated skin. So two drops, three drops go a very long way. So I totally recommend you guys try this if you're trying to get rid of your stretch marks. Um, again, if you have any acne marks, um, uneven skin tone, um, I think this would be great for you. And it smells really pretty too. So, and this can be just like a part of your nighttime routine. If you don't like oil on you like during the day or when you shower in the mornings, maybe at night right before you go to bed, you go ahead and slather this all over or wherever you need it. And you won't even know that it's there because you're sleeping. <laughs> and I think you will notice a difference in whatever it is that you're trying to get rid of. Ooh, how am I doing? I have a long ways to go. Okay. This one's kind of a given. I don't know if you don't like this place, something's wrong with you. <laughs> no, but um, I'm a huge fan of Bath & Body Works candles, especially the stress relief scent. Especially for a home, you just wanna be comfortable and cozy. I feel like this is the best scent. 
Um, my mom likes using the body scrubs and the soaps and the lotions. So I love those too, but I kind of just want this smell for like an all over kind of house smell. So when people walk in, they just automatically feel cozy and comfortable. And that's kind of what I get from this scent. Obviously stress relief makes you feel easy, cozy, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, this is kind of a given favorite. And next, next is another random thing. My phone case, <clears throat> my phone case. Um, I don't like, and this is gonna sound really bad of me or not very ladylike or girl-like, but I don't like carrying purses or wallets. And so I'm always having a hard time, or for a while I was having a hard time, you know, carrying my card with me, my ID with me, because since I didn't like having purses or wallets, I would kind of just leave them everywhere or just put it in my pocket when I leave, come home, take it out and put it on the table somewhere and lose it. So I invested in this, got it on Amazon, and I just put my, my license and then just like my debit card in here and I never lose it. I mean, unless you're really unfortunate and you lose your phone and then you lose all of it together. But knock on wood, that hasn't happened. I don't think I've ever lost my phone. Uh, so yeah, it's, I mean, it looks cool. It's not just like a, a wallet on your phone. Um, it just, there's different colors and stuff. And they have a bunch of different kinds on Amazon, but this one kind of just fit my style, my cup of tea. And um, yeah, that one was random. Um, next, we're gonna get into makeup brushes. I needed to put some sort of makeup in here. And all my makeup brushes, except for like maybe one or two that were on um, BoxyCharm, all of them are from BH Cosmetics. BH Cosmetics brushes are extremely affordable and they, they are just great quality. And a lot of the times they come in little um, packages whether you have the face brush, you know, the contour brush, the eye brush, eyebrow brush, and they're, it's just very convenient. But then they also have the individuals as well. So these are some of the new ones I actually just got, but I have always used BH Cosmetics. And like I said, they're very soft. They don't, whenever you wash them, I know if you get like drugstore brushes, like you'll see, the, you'll see them start to come out here. I know I've gotten some Real Technique ones, um, brushes, and they started to come up, the little hair started to fall off and get out of this little area. So I didn't like that, but I like these. These are very good to me. And I think these are the only brushes I'll probably ever buy. I know a lot of people rave about uh, Morphe brushes and they're, you know, they're affordable, yes, but I think these ones are a little bit more affordable and great quality. So if you need some brushes, I recommend BH Cosmetics. And if I keep looking that way, it's because I can see my reflection. So make sure that I look good, okay? And this is the last thing that is not gonna be fitness related. I'm a huge, huge sunglass junkie. I love sunglasses. I think there's always a different one for a different outfit. And I love it. <laughs> I have a lot more, but these are kind of just like my two favorites at the moment. Are they dirty? Probably. It's the best it's gonna get. So these glasses I see more for like a beach, poolside, summer vibe. And I think these are super cute. Kind of go with this look a little bit. I feel like, I don't know what they're called, but I call them the hipster glasses. That's kind of how I see them. So I like those. And then these ones are kind of, well not kind of, they, these are my everyday glasses. I love this style, I love the shape of them. And I have some black ones as well but these ones are just it for me. If you ever see me driving or walking down the street, which I really don't do, or at the mall, 
when they open. Um, I'll be wearing these. These are kind of just like my everyday. I feel comfortable, I feel cute. I feel like, hey, what's up? Yeah, so yeah, these are <laughs> my glasses. Now, coffee break. I wonder if my neighbors can hear me. Why are they like, what is she doing? Okay, now everything else here on out is gonna be finished really good. In the least fitness related I don't know we're just gonna we're just gonna go into this so um, we work out hmm I love Alani Yip. their flavors are awesome I've tried a good amount of other kind of uh, pre-workouts and they're always too strong or too sweet and I never, I, I don't know if you're supposed to enjoy taking pre-workout, but I want to enjoy taking pre-workout. So I came across this brand a while ago. Actually, one of my coworkers, she was using it for a while and then she grew out of it because, you know, she's strong and all. <laughs> um, so she kind of inspired me to go ahead and, you know, try out some stuff. And the first one I've ever tried out was actually the pre-workout Hawaiian shaped ice. This one's very good this one's sweet but not too sweet and it actually tastes like hawaiian shaved ice and this is the new one that i've recently purchased and this is the pink guava it's different than what i thought it was gonna be but it's still good it's not as sweet as this one so if you're not a sweet person i recommend this one if you are this one and they have a bunch of other um flavors they have like a mimosa flavor they have like a white grape if i'm not mistaken and a whole bunch of others so i recommend you just check out their website they have pre-workout they have um, collagen stuff they have um bcaas they have vitamins actually i have vitamins here too I actually take their vitamins the i have the omega gummies and then i also have the probiotics I take some other stuff too, like I take their balance pills. Those ones are meant to help with your hormones and balance them out. And then I also take their fat burners, but these are the two that I really like out of like their vitamins and stuff. Um, but yeah, overall, they're just a really great brand and I'm very true and loyal to them. <laughs> so if you're just, I, I personally feel like if you're just starting out with working out, um, and you want to try you know some supplements some you know vitamins whatever it is um, I really recommend you just checking out their page There's that. and then headphones I've always been a beat person I've never been into airpods and stuff like that I've never owned any nor do I probably want to but these are the airpod pros airpod pros <laughs> <laughs> these are the beat pros <laughs> these are the beat pros i have them in the army green i think it's called army green and i use these for working out is a thumbs up for me the only bad thing is that the box is pretty bulky but it's not, it's not like it's gonna bug me or anything i'm not gonna work out with them in my pocket like if i when, when i was going to the gym when they were open um i would just put them in my bag put this box in my bag and then just take my air just take my airpods oh my god here we go again um just take my beats and that wouldn't bug me so i know sometimes it just it discourages people from buying you know these because of the actual casing but i mean you're not gonna take it working out with you you're gonna leave it somewhere in your bag or in your car or something you know so that doesn't bug me so, uh, but I do recommend these. These are very nice. They're very loud. They're very comfortable. They don't fall off. Um, if that's a concern of yours. Um, what else can I say about them? Um, they're just like AirPods 2. You take one out. It pauses the music for you. Put it back in. It plays it. Uh, yeah, like I just, I don't know what else to say about them other than they're great and I love them. And I think I'm always going to forever be a Beats person. What is that? Next. This is the bag that I was talking about that I use at the gym, or I used to use at the gym. 
This is so cute and it's pink. All my friends know that I love pink. Uh, I love it, it's very convenient. Uh, when I go to the gym, I don't take a lot of stuff with me. I take my keys, extra rubber bands, my water, my lock, my, my headphones. I mean, and that's kind of it. But obviously I don't want to carry all that around with me, so this is perfect. And it has a little magnet on top. You can magnetize that thing. Go like that and you're good. <laughs> yeah, I think this is super cute. Nike.com, okay. Next is this Sweet Sweat Waist Trainer. I know you guys have all seen it, whether you wanted to or not, because it's advertised everywhere. But I truly believe that this works and it helps you with your waist. I, mm, I wear it, I wanna say at least two to three times a week when I work out. I don't wear it every single day, which would probably, I'd probably get more results that way. But there's some days where I'm doing high intensity and I don't want anything in my way. And then there's those other days where I'm just focusing on my abs, I'm focusing on um, like my arms and stuff. So usually when I do arms and ab days, I will wear this. But when I'm doing legs and hit, um, I won't wear this but that's just my preference but i really do recommend this it's not uncomfortable that's not the reason why i wear it during hit days and leg days um i just i don't know it's just my preference um but yeah it's, it, it is comfortable it is pretty snug um it's not bulky and you won't, you won't really see it outside of your clothes you just you know that it's there but it's not noticeable but i do recommend this if you're trying to slim your waist down and look cute little ow uh, Hourglass figure. Jesus Lord. I need help. Um, next. Oh. Next are my resistant bands. I have the little rubber ones, but I'm a huge fan of these ones. These are nice and thick. This is the like medium and this is like the heavy. Uh, I don't know. I just feel like these, these are, have way more resistance than these bands. These ones I use when, um, I actually will use them when I'm sitting down watching TV actually, and I'll use them around my arms, and I'll just be like this during uh, watching TV and stuff, and it really helps with your shoulders, it helps with your like, little booby area. So I use these mainly for that, but I'll also use them for legs too, you know, the little butt cakes and sidekicks. Um, and I'll do pulses, so that's when I really use them. But if I really want to get a good resistant like band workout, I will use these ones. These ones are really thick, they're very sturdy, they won't break, and I just prefer these ones. So, again, Amazon. And I think we're down to the last few things. Now, this is kind of a given. If you worked with me, you know me, you're my friend, you know this comes everywhere with me. And I hope you thought about it before I show you. I think Jack. I love it. When if look at work, people know that I'm at work when they see this. Like I work in the back and instantly once you walk through those doors, you see this, oh Bree's here. Like everyone knows that. I love this jug, obviously because it's pink. But I mean, you get so much use out of this. How much does it hold? 2.2 liters. And when I'm at work, I fill this up three to four times when I'm at work. So I get hydrated. Let me tell you, I stay hydrated. Right now I'm having a hard time because it's just your home. But you want to be hydrated and you want to you know be consistent with your water which you should be I should be we should be um, I recommend you get jugs this will really keep you on your toes and they're pretty and this is $20 some people might be expensive but you're gonna be using it for a very long time so you're gonna get your money's worth so I don't think that's a bad price for this they have a bunch of colors like a bunch so Hydro Jug is the website, is the company, is the brand, 
and I think you should check it out. Now, a lot of you guys, my coworkers, that follow me on here. So yes, I am a Nike girl. I am a Nike athlete. I work for Nike. But look, we're in quarantine. I'm experimenting with like different clothes, supplements, everything. So, you know, I do a little something. I bought, don't be mad at me coworkers, friends, <laughs> Nike peeps. But, um, well, I invested or I purchased some Gymshark leggings. Um, and I'm not mad at it. <laughs> These are so flattering on me, their butt. They have little uh, holes on the side, so they're very breathable, very stretchy, but they suck you in, but they don't feel like they're sucking you in. Like it doesn't, it doesn't feel uncomfortable. You just feel nice. And they're squat proof. So yeah, I just, as much as I will forever promote Nike, I suggest if you want to branch out of Nike, just, you know, once or twice, not always, um, these are very nice to try out. And this is another brand that I invested in, but just for this, because I've been looking for shirts like this for so long and I can't find them anywhere. They're all really thick or just have a different cut in the back. And I just like these to lounge around the house. And they have a beautiful material. Like they're not thick, it's not thin. It's very soft, very stretchy, but it's not see-through. And they have very, they have a lot of different colors, but this is kind of the one for me. Matches my skin tone, flatters me. Not really, but I just liked this color. But that's the only reason why I really got this is because of the cut. I just, honestly, I don't even work out with this. This is actually a workout brand. Um, I don't work out with this, I just lounge around it and sleep in it. But it's very comfortable. And honestly, I think that's it. I'm kind of scared to see how long this video is. But anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope I did a great job. And I'll see you guys next time.